My name is Ed McEwen. I live outside of Jericho Springs, Missouri, and I have a Lumbermate 2000 that I bought in 2004. The, a tornado had gone through our land and, and knocked down almost all the big trees, so I didn't want them to go away. I'd uh, always wanted a mill. Uh, the tornado uh, gave me an excuse to buy a sawmill, and I used the lumber from the sawmill originally to add on to my house. Well, the mill does everything I, I needed it to do. Uh, my only regret with, with my Norwood sawmill is I didn't get the 23 horsepower Briggs. I got the 15 horsepower Kohler. So uh, there are times when I wish I had more horsepower. And I would recommend that to anybody buying a sawmill to buy the most that you can afford. I got the four foot bed extension. Uh, I got, and I got their cam dog. And uh, I got a, I bought an extra log dog post set, which helped a lot with long logs. Their, uh, it was a manual tow board and log roller, which I liked. The sawmill has been very a very reliable tool. Uh, there's very few parts that I've had to replace, but mainly it's just maintenance items. It's been a really dependable machine. I know I can always count on the motor, and I can always count on the machine to handle anything I can put through it. I sawn up all this lumber, right, maybe some high quality stuff, walnut and, and good oak, and, and I really had to do something with it. <laughs> so uh, I became, became a, a serious woodworker. I'd always done woodworking, but uh, with inadequate tools. So I, I uh, purchased some good tools and built a shop, and I framed that shop with, with also with oak that I, uh, that I cut on my sawmill. I made my cabinets, there's 50-some drawers on them. That, that was my beginning foray into serious woodworking. The thrust of my uh, pursuit is just to enhance my own lifestyle, to, to make uh, nice things around the house, things for the house that I couldn't otherwise afford. So I've got parts from them, but I... Unfortunately for them, I haven't needed very many parts because nothing seems to break. I have bought uh, roller bearings and belts and and accessories. Yeah, they've always been friendly and they and helpful. This uh, this sawmill, you know, I haven't ever had any problem with it. I would probably buy a, a brand new Norwood if I if I needed another one, which I don't expect to do but uh, I'm completely satisfied with their quality of workmanship and especially their design. Mm -hmm.